Hello everyone, I am Tabit and I am here to answer some of your guys' questions. First question is, could you please introduce yourself for people who didn't know you? Well, once again, my name is Tabit. I am a singer-songwriter and I recently came out with a mini album called Up and Down. And uh, it has three tracks, Up and Down, Lonely Love, and The Rain Song. So that's a little bit about me. Next question is, what made you want to become a musician? What inspired you to make music? Basically, the inspiration for music, uh, to do music, basically I think came from my lack of being able to express myself daily. And I think I used to be not a very expressive person. I didn't talk about my feelings. And kind of music was a way to escape into, escape from reality and to get those emotions out in a healthy way. So I think basically that's what pushed me to do music and that's just part of my personality and that's just who I am. I'm meant to do music. <laughs> so next question. What made you interested in music to the point you decided to make it your job? I mean, many people are in love with the arts, but they keep it a hobby. For me, I felt like if I didn't express myself through music, I would have suffocated and there's no other job that I could really think of that would have really made me happy. So it was an issue about being happy and being content with who I'm supposed to be and music basically filled that empty spot for me and yeah I mean they say do what you love and if you work hard enough you can make money off of it and here I am. <laughs> so next question, do you remember your first time on stage, your first concert? What did you feel when you go on stage? So, I do. First time I had to perform after I debuted was Christmas of 2013, I believe. Uh, around Christmas. It was Christmas concert right after I debuted. And I was super nervous because I was too caught up in trying to impress people rather than to have fun and to just have fun with my fans and now my mentality has changed but back then I was very caught up in trying to sing well and trying to make everyone think that I was this huge singer so yeah I mean I've changed a lot I've come a long way from then all right the next question is which subject topics did you choose to talk about through your lyrics a lot of my lyrics uh, the subjects that they talk about are very young topics so I feel like I'm still young in general and I still have a lot to learn about love about life so I mean I, I don't try to be more than I am and I feel like I have a lot to learn so my lyrics in a sense they're very immature and kind of whiny in a sense <laughs> but uh, that's who I am and that's where I get my inspiration from which is my life so I mean yeah I mean that's basically what my lyrics usually end up being. It's just stories of my life. Alright, next question is, is there a country in particular that you would like to visit? Uh, let's see. I visited a lot of countries that I've wanted to visit very much. Uh, one country that I wasn't able to visit that I would love to visit would probably be Spain because they have a lot of good food. So I hear. <laughs> Alright, next question is, what do you think about France and Paris? Do you like the country, the city, and the food? The food, yes. I love, 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 love the French food. And I didn't get to eat too much of it, but uh, you guys have amazing desserts. And whew, yeah, if I stayed in your country too long, I'd probably become big like this and you'd have to roll me out of the airport. But... <laughs> I really do love your food and your city is so beautiful. Paris was one of the most beautiful cities I'm not even exaggerating that I've seen in my whole entire life and I definitely know that I need to go back to Paris someday to tour so Yes, and uh, Next question is is there a song that you would like to specially introduce to the French fans? All right, uh out of my songs that I would like to introduce to my French fans would probably be, huh? Let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna say one track that you probably haven't heard 
is Lonely Love and uh, it's a very jazzy song. It's very smooth and ballady and very jazzy. So I think you guys might like it. So listen to Lonely Love, second track on my most recent album, Up and Down. And after this tour, what are your plans? My plans for after this tour is to relax, eat some good food. Wait, I kind of feel like I'm already doing the second part. I'm eating a lot of good food. So I think just relaxing uh, and I'm looking forward to doing nothing. Maybe watching some TV shows, uh, just eating, hanging out with friends. I need maybe a couple weeks of break. I think that would be nice. <laughs> And the last question is, could you leave a message for your French fans? Yes, of course. Bonjour, everyone. Uh, je suis David. Uh, and I love you guys. You guys have been with me for a really long time. And I'm very thankful for everything that you've done for me. Uh, I was very honored to go to Paris to be able to perform there. And hopefully, I'll be able to come back to see you guys again because I'm going to miss it so much. So please invite me back or come to Korea to see me. And I will see you guys later. Thank you. Bye.